Hey guys, welcome to KK Java Tutorials. In this video tutorial, we are going to learn how to see the MySQL Workbench query history. So guys, sometimes what happens, you write the complex query, right? And you forgot to save, right? And you want those query back, right? Then how we can do that in the MySQL Workbench? So MySQL Workbench always maintains the history. So whatever query you execute, that always maintains the history. Let's say if I run this query, select a star from uh, orders details, right? So this has been recorded into the history and where we can see here, you can see the action output, right? So there is a drop down. So last option you could see history output. So select that one and here you can see. So whatever query I had executed on the uh, 3rd August 2021. So all those history is going to maintain so i can take any of the existing query so if you click then that that is going to display on the query sheet so let's say if i click on this query so this query is going to display on the query sheet right similarly there is a, a query history maintains for the 5th august then 6th august 7th august and 8th august as well right that's how basically my school workbench maintains the history and you can retrieve the query back Right, so that's all I wanted to show in this video tutorial. Thank you.